Minecraft is a persistent world next-gen shooter. Persistent world being that we can have up to 1,500 players in a, a, a server uh, next-gen because we use the Unreal 3 engine and it's a shooter. At, at its heart, it's a shooter. It's a squad-based tactical shooter. We have, instead of a squad, we have gangs. Your, your gang uh, is going to go into instances. We don't have any open field uh, uh, PvE, PvP, but we do it all pretty much in instances where we want players to go into PvE or PvP and fight with their gang as a, as a squad. We have. Uh, we have uh, voice over IP chat, we have, uh, we have crafting, banks, we have all the trappings of an MMO, but we're just, we, we do all the safe area, your safe districts is where you're going to meet with your friends, you're going to do all your services, you're going to go to the bank, you're going to go to the auction house, you're going to do all the, uh, all the MMO trappings, but we try to, because we're trying to please two crowds, shooter crowds and uh, MMO crowds, we want to try to cut down the, the, the amount of interaction that you have to do. We have a story, it's a, it's a basis, and we want the players to actually feed into the story, tell us where it's gonna go. It's a, it's not apocalyptic, but we're definitely circling the bowl. It's uh, 30 years in the future, It's, it's the world's falling apart, government is gone. Uh, we have these little these cities that are uh, uh, little enclaves that people are, are huddled inside of with walls all around, and you have, when you go outside the walls, it's pretty much fighting just crazy gangs, militias, all, all kinds of stuff. At start, you can, you know, you choose your gender, and, and but there's no classes. It's not class-based. You turn around, you jump in, uh, you it's all ability-based, so we're not pigeonholing you with a class. If you want to be the guy who's a light machine gun guy who, who hoses people down or a sniper, you, you just choose the abilities that complement your gameplay style. Uh, we're going to have quite a few maps. Right now, we have the three large uh, safe districts that all have all your services. We're going to have uh, 14 instances at long launch for PvP. We have a couple PvE instances and we only have PvE instances really to try to transition MMO players over. We want MMO players to be able to turn around and say, hey, you know, I want to try it, but I don't really like PvP. Let me try to work into the PvE, get a handle on the guns and how it works, and then I'll try to dip my toes into the PvP a little bit. Crimecraft will be available on the PC August 25th.